to hook him up with a portrait of a special someone in his life. And for this tattoo, he's definitely come to the right artist. Hi, I'm Steve. Cat, nice to meet you. Nice to meet cool. you. Have a seat. So what's up, man? What do you, what, what you want? Uh, <laughs> I want to get a portrait of my cat, Buddy. Yeah. I came to LA today to get tattooed of a portrait of my cat, because he's my best friend in the entire world. So What's hey. his name? Buddy. 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 Cool. Where are we going to put Buddy at? I'm going to get him on the inside of my leg. OK, let's There's see it. Barely any room left on it. <laughs> I know. You're covered, man. But I have a big spot, like, right through here. Okay. So I'm going to put him basically like the size of my hand, like at an angle. And I want to do I'm more of a full coverage type of guy. So I want to, like, try to expand out. I'll or... do, like, a background and stuff on it. You know what I mean? Like, I'll, I'll do yeah, all yeah. this stuff. Steve brought in this really cool picture of his cat, Buddy. And he wants to get a portrait of it today. I'm pretty excited about doing it. I, I love tattooing portraits of people's pets. Cool. I'll uh, come back with a line drawing, and then we'll size it up. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, man. I did my best to rock out the sketch of Steve's cat. I hope he loves this portrait almost as much as he does his kitty. Yeah, that fits him perfectly. Good, right? Yeah. Yeah! That's rocks. Aww. Buddy is my very first pet. He's basically like a child to me, so I wanted to get him immortalized. I moved out here from the Midwest and got really lonely and broke up with a girl and just was going through, you know, some interesting times, to say the least. Yeah. So thought I wanted a companion. So we went down to the SPCA and Oh my goodness, I must have sold dozens and dozens of cats there. As soon as I walked into the room, I sat down on the floor, Buddy came right over, sat right in my lap, and started purring. So I adopted him. The reason I'm getting him tattooed is that uh, I just took him on a normal vet visit. They go, oh, well, he may have kidney problems. So it made me think that he may not be around for as long as I, I hope he is. So I better, you know get this tattoo done, you know, soon so he can enjoy it. We're pretty much soulmates. It sounds crazy, but I s swear I know what he's talking about all the time. Like, he'll just give me a look, and I just know exactly what he needs. You know, recently, like, I've been going through my own hard times, and I, I just wanted a little positive ball of light to come home to every day. I just recently got my own cat, Ludwig. He's my hairless cat, and he's kind of like the shop mascot. Baby! Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness! Oh. oh my goodness. Hello. Every time I look into his eyes, I can't be mad or sad, and uh, he's definitely helped me out a lot. Go prance around the shop. Mm. Oh man, I love him. He cuddles with me at night and listens to me. Animals, I think, are really amazing things to have in people's lives. Cool. I want you to go and check it out in the mirror, so you're looking at him right side up. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, that looks just like him. Yes. It's so beautiful. Thank you so much. I literally can't tell the difference between the tattoo and the photo. It came out so much better than I could even hope that it would. I'm very, very happy and very proud to have him on my leg now and be able to show everybody just how much I love him. All right, Ludwig. You sit, I'll sit on your lap. OK. Oh. Here goes. Thank you again so much. I'm sure Buddy's going to be so excited when he sees it. I can't it. wait till he sees it. Yeah. Cool. Bye. Bye, sweetie.